What's going on my friend, Danny here from youngat30.com and in this video I'm going to talk about how you can enhance your exercise performance with magnesium. So how do we increase or enhance our exercise performance? Well, in order to do this we need to increase our oxidative capacity. Now what is oxidative capacity? It's basically the ability of our cells to absorb oxygen and this is critical when it comes to exercise because in order for our muscles to work they need oxygen. The more oxygen we can get to our muscles the harder they can work and the better we can actually perform when it comes to exercising. So it turns out that oxidative capacity is very dependent on something called mitochondria. Now I love mitochondria, I blog about them a lot and I'll be talking about them a lot in future videos to give more detail. But for now, let me just say that mitochondria are basically tiny little organelles that live inside our cells. They form this part of the structure of our cells and they are responsible for producing the energy of our cells and the energy of our bodies. And this energy we use from everything from blinking to thinking. It's called ATP or adenosine triphosphate and it's often referred to as the energy currency of the cells or the body. And as such, mitochondria are known as the power stations of the cells because they are responsible for producing this ATP. Now as humans, we can go months without food, we can go days without water, we can go minutes without oxygen, but when it comes to ATP, we can only go about 10 seconds and that's how critical it is. So oxidative capacity is dependent on our mitochondria. Now, in order to increase our oxidative capacity, we can do two things. Number one, we can make new mitochondria, and that's a process called mitochondrial biogenesis, and that's done by stressing the body, and actually exercise is a great way for mitochondrial biogenesis. It's a great way to make new mitochondria. So that's method one, make new mitochondria. Method two is to repair the damage to our existing mitochondria. Now, unfortunately, mitochondria get damaged every day and that's part of life. Um, it happens when we eat, it happens when we breathe. It's basically damage caused by ROS or reactive oxygen species, which is a natural product, a natural byproduct of breathing and eating and living, basically. So we want to make sure that the damage to our mitochondria is repaired. So those are the two ways. Number one, make new mitochondria, and number two, repair damage to existing mitochondria. Now, in order for these two processes to work, we need enzymes to do them. Enzymes are the things that actually do the work. And in order for enzymes to do their job properly, they require a cofactor, which is, you guessed it, magnesium. So without magnesium, these enzymes can still um, do their job, they can still repair mitochondria, they can still make new mitochondria, but they just don't do it as efficiently as if they had the cofactor to hand. So it's really important that we have sufficient levels of magnesium in our bodies. And unfortunately, a lot of the population is actually deficient in magnesium. So make sure you get enough magnesium. Where do we get it from? Well, it's actually found in dark green leafy vegetables. The magnesium is actually what gives the dark green leafy vegetables their dark green color. So if you eat things like spinach and kale, um, eat plenty of that, you'll be getting lots of magnesium. So that's basically it guys. So just a quick recap. In order to enhance our exercise performance, we need to increase our oxidative capacity. And in order to do this, so we can number one, make new mitochondria, and number two, uh, repair the damage to existing mitochondria and that is done via enzymes that require a cofactor which is magnesium. So make sure you get your magnesium from dark green leafy vegetables. That's it guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked it please hit the like button and if you'd like to see more videos like this please subscribe and until the next video have a great day and I'll see you later.